to be here on the MBAS stage, isn't it, Bruce? This is awesome. This is a big highlight for us. Yes. <laughs> I've been coming here for lots of years watching artists, and here we are. Here we are. Who would have known? <laughs> All right, we have an album launch tonight. Um, we have albums for sale. The next song is um, called Gone Astray Blues, written by Mr... Bruce McHale on our right. Now, how did we do this, this Bruce? This is my attempt at writing a, a Memphis Mini type of song. Um, and um, it was very folky originally, but we got together with, uh, I got together with Louise and we changed it around a bit and turned it into this, basically. I 
gonna find my daddy I think it's kind of strange They said he's living the high life Off in another town Yeah, he's living the high life He's off in another town Drag him home with me Well, I'll find him I'm gonna drag his ass home with me As for his new lady She wouldn't wanna mess with me I'm leaving this town I've gotta get away Yeah, I'm leaving this town Find my daddy, I think it's gone astray. I gotta find my daddy. Few months ago, we released it. Yeah, we did. We put it out as a single, got a bit of radio play. Yes. Thank you, Barry, up in Sunbury. Yes, thank you, Barry Maxwell. <laughs> yes. yes, this one's called You Ed to James Treat ain't, My Man. Ain't nobody gonna tell me how to treat my man. There ain't nobody like gonna tell me how to do that, even if I had one. <laughs>
Oh, this one I heard. I heard the lyrics to this one. Ruthie Foster. When I heard the lyrics, I thought, yeah, this is a bit what I think about the blues. I just love the blues. This is to all those people out there that say, oh, what's blues? This explains it all. This explains it all.
thank you very much. Thank you so much. As I said before, this is our album launch, and we're so proud to have an album. It's a labour of love for us. We spent a lot of time on it, didn't we? Yeah, we did. You know, we killed each other? No, Just about. We, yeah. I think we came out right in the end. Yes, yes, we're still alive. <laughs> we're both still here, yes. All right, next one is a Memphis Mini. This is Memphis. This is, actually was written by Memphis Mini. It one. was, yeah, yeah. We do love a bit of Memphis Mini. We did first start uh, introduced Memphis Mini and the Women in Blues, and yeah, this stuff is really good. Let's do some stuff now. Nice guitarist here, Bruce McCall, on my right. Are you on my right? Yeah, I was here. Yes, thank you very much. He does a fantastic job. So, I'm just tuning up. Let's tune up. Eric Bibb once said that um, guitar tuning is a very good thing. Like, um, I just ruined that joke. Never mind. <laughs> Stick the playing the guitar. Oh, well, good on you. That was the punchline, sorry. <laughs> I'm going to stop talking and... Oh, come on, a bit more talking. <laughs>
everybody yes it is albums for sale up the back there I can sign them too <laughs> yeah <coughs> the fabulous right. Thunderbirds the fabulous Thunderbirds yes. right. let's, let's pick up the pace just a little <laughs>
too When I'm with my baby's arms He knows just what to do I'm walking to my baby Yeah, I'm walking to my baby Yes, I'm walking to my baby Cause his loving's what walking for Yes, I'm walking to my baby Cause his loving's what walking for Good-looking bunch of people we have here tonight. I can't really. see right now. It's too hot. I can see. I can see some of them. I have some family here. It's very, very Yay. special. My lovely daughter over here. On the and a surprise guest. Oh, well, what a surprise! Anyway, I'm going to not look at her at the moment, but I do love you. All right, this is. Oh, this is a great song. This is from the movie A Colour Purple, and I, I did this in a lockdown. I sang it and sang it and sang it till I oh, felt like it was going okay. So this is called Miss Seely's Blues. Yeah, we haven't told 
them. Which one? You said you were going to tell them. We were going to tell them. Oh, you were. Anyway, who told them? <laughs> Welcome, everybody. We want to thank the MBAS, the Melbourne Blues Appreciation Society, for having us this evening. Thank you very much to John Durr and Ali. Yes, but. All right, this, this one? Yes, I will. Well, this is this this is a song I wrote in the first Women in Blues that I did. I did two. This is just before we went into lockdown, and I was seeing a man at the time. Well, actually, I was seeing him, but he wasn't seeing me. <laughs> like that sort of stuff. Big mistake, y'all. What do you think? Big mistake. Anyway, I wrote a song about this. He's no longer around. I don't, I don't care where he is, really. But anyway. He missed out on this. I mean, yeah. Oh, stupid man. Anyway, let's just... And I don't like anybody wasting my time. I felt like I've wasted too much time thinking about it. Don't ever do that, girls. They're not worth it. But I love men, though. I've got to say that. To all the men, the beautiful men in the audience here. I do love men. Thank you. That deserves it. Oh, oh yes, Bruce, you're a nice man. Yeah. <laughs> Don't waste my time. Cause I've got no time to waste. Don't waste my time. Cause I've got no time to waste. I don't understand why you don't love a woman like me. You see, I need a man who will love me for who I am. I need a man who will love me for who I am. Treat me so bad. Like you don't even give a damn I'm tired of waiting for you To decide what you're gonna do I'm tired of waiting for you To decide what you're gonna do Feels like I'm hanging Hanging on to nothing with you Anything you want. Anything I want. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, right. 
Yeah, right. Married man telling me that. This is Nina Simone. This is Nina Simone. We're going to get in the zone now. Imagine you're in a, a smoky club somewhere, but a bit smaller than this. And we've got the spot, single spotlight on, on us both. Have we? Yes. Oh, yeah. Just imagine. Oh, get on with it. Come on. <laughs>
like you should be, yeah, yeah. Why you treat me like you do? If you love me like you say, baby, why you treat me like you do? Well, I ain't no fool. I'm cool, I know the rules. Well, I ain't no fool. to a Memphis Mini that uh, I did in the second Women in Blues, thanks to John Durr, introducing me to Memphis Mini. Therefore, Bruce, did you know Memphis Mini before you knew me? I had an album of hers. That's, that was oh, that was how I got the job. This is her, oh, that's right. Not only heard of Memphis Mini, I actually had one of her records. What job? This job. <laughs> yes, Miss Lee's Blues job. Okay, let's do our job. <laughs> I'm so glad you're all here tonight, by the way. This song is called I'm So Glad. I'm so glad I don't know what to do. I'm so glad I don't know what to do. Well, I woke up this morning. Yo! 
to you. Thanks for having me. When I first heard the lyrics of this song, I thought, this is so cheeky and cute. This is right up my alley. I love cheeky lyrics. It's about, it's a Debbie Davies number. It's about a uh, woman that found some scratches on her man's back. And she didn't put them there. No, she didn't. And neither did he. Yeah. So yeah, she's trying to figure out where they came from. Here's how it goes. Thank you so much. Thanks, John Dewey. Thank you, everyone.